Hello, VW Lifers. Well, guess what? Things happen fast in this Volkswagen world, Matt Jackson and Jake Garrison. Ladies and gentlemen, we are on our way to go rescue a 67. A 67 what? A uh, VW Beetle. A 67 VW Beetle with so many cool special parts. We are excited. Original paint. It's looking good. We saw the pictures. We are headed up to that famous place called Wacko, Texas. Let's roll, boys. That's right. 67 was a lot of one-year only parts, so we don't know what we're going to find. We're just going to go up there and see what we can get into. It's all adventure from here. That's right. What do you think, Jake? Hell yeah. That's it. You heard it from the fans. Let's, let's do it. Let's go. This is VW Life. If you're into car restorations or adventure or anything, you're at the right place. So consider uh, subscribing. Oh yes, mostly adventure. Yes. <laughs> Lots of adventure. Lots of adventure. So a couple of things on a Volkswagen Rescue, what we like to bring with us. We like to bring a complete set of rollers. Okay, that's tires. In this case, wide fives, we already have them ready to go. We got a floor jack so we can get up. Whoa, we're stopping really quick. So that's another thing. Right now, we still don't have a trailer. We're getting one, so we're using a tow bar. That's another thing we're doing. We have a whole box, it's just ready to go. It's called the VW Rescue. Inside that, we've got grease, a uh, set of bearings, uh, the lights, tow lights, penetrating oil, like, you know, Kiwi Blaster, that kind of stuff. Uh, blocks of wood, all kinds of things of that nature. We also have our bag of tools that we take everywhere. You're familiar with that if you've watched some of our videos. We got an air tank just to have some extra air, some of the, the tires are on it, so make sure you can roll that kind of thing along that line. And uh, in the grand scheme of things, that's basically it. I mean, you know, you paperwork. want work. Oh, yeah, yes, and of course, you always want to have uh, paperwork for your title transfer form so you can get the right signatures and that kind of thing, too. In this case, uh, uh, this uh, Beetle does have a, uh, have a title. That's a good thing. Okay, Gary, so yeah, 67 had a bunch of one-year only parts, right? Hey, yeah, Matt Jackson, um, it did. Uh, 67 Beetles were a big transition year for Volkswagens. Um, it's the first uh, went from 6 to 12 volt, so that's kind of a cool thing there. Um, of course, you had the headlights, you know, you kind of like a more modern headlight. You didn't have the glass lens over the seal beam anymore, so it's more of a modern look there. One of the coolest things, too, is the deck lid was a little bit larger on the back, so uh, the towel bars on the rear bumper have a kind of a slant. They slant in. And the unique thing that is is sometimes you'll see those on like other cars, like, how'd they get on there? Probably at the time, let's say you had an accident, well, uh, you know, like maybe after 69 or 70, and you get like in your 64, well, then you would have to only the only uh, towel bars they have for the rear were the 67 only because that's what they were manufacturing at, at that point. So if you went to Volkswagen, that's what you ended up with. That. There was a lot of uh, one-year only parts. We don't know them all, but our friend Eric Shoemaker has a website called 1967beetle.com. Right? Yeah. I can put a link to that in the description below. Yes, and man, what a great website and a lot of good knowledge. Uh, on Eric's the website. Yep, and uh, he has an email and, list. He'll send out yes. emails. It's really and, cool. And so. uh, uh, parts too. Man, he's got some really nice parts that he yep. refurbishes. Does a really nice job on some stuff. Yeah, so check out the link below. Yep. Okay, we got some dark clouds ahead. Yeah, Matt Jackson, things just got real. Yeah, looking at the radar, there's a huge radar, there's a huge cloud coming right where we're gonna be. Yeah, not scared. Not scared? No, not scared. Okay. But here's the deal, Matt Jackson, when you're going on a VW rescue, some things you just don't worry about, like the weather. That's right. Tornadoes. Been there. The hurricanes. Got it. Earthquake. We have earthquakes here? No. Uh, yeah, fracking. Fracking, fracking. yeah, no okay. fracking. I hate fracking. God. Anyway. We'll just get a little bit wet, yeah, it'll be fine. stay tuned, because this could get a little hairy. Rolling through the storm of the century. Well, you ever notice a lot of everything we go through is a storm of the century? But it's coming down pretty good. Good Texas thunderstorm. Um, hopefully it's gonna pass. We're still about 20 minutes out from uh, where we're headed. Right, we're pulling up on the 
property now and uh, we're gonna see what goes down and we're gonna bring you guys back as soon as we uh, have some information. That's the plan, right Matt Jackson? This is the exciting part. We're all nervous, it gets kind of quiet. Oh yeah, so we're in the vehicle. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Matt Jackson, here we go. We're taking uh, the white 67. Uh, it has been repainted. It's, it's a lovely shade of white, refrigerator white. But it started right up, went into reverse. It's really not too bad. No? Whoa. It has brakes, kinda. Seats are really padded, aren't they? Yeah, these are good seats. Yeah. That's third gear. There's no telling how old these tires are. He said 2000. Yeah, we're switching them out. I mean, we just went into fourth. I think that noise is a throw out bearing. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Because if, if as soon as I put it in neutral, I don't hear any bearing. You, hear any, you don't hear any bearing noise. Do you? Nothing like that. Yeah. Went through the gears. Uh, I mean, brakes probably need to be adjusted for sure. Bled, that kind of thing. Headliner, needs a headliner. No rusted battery tray. Actually, the, the pans look really good. Yeah, that, I mean, almost to the point where like, uh, have these been replaced, but they're not. It's very dry, except for the front. It just had water in the nose. Got a little bit of an exhaust leak. Well, we've taken the test drive, but uh, now the now the fun really begins. Yeah, really. We got to see what we can negotiate. Jake's back. Uh, see what else else. I think the other stuff he has he has a lot of parts. Yeah. Um. Uh, you know, I mean, it's not a cream puff, but it's a good. I think it's a good solid place to start. It pulls fine. Yeah, it's got good power. Yeah. Start it right up. Yeah. Shoots fine. Well, we got it. We're just putting new wheels on it. Just kind of put the little things right there and you slide the pins through this, this goes around the beam and then two pins hold them in and then you can tow it there it goes Okay, we're pretty full back here with lots of parts. Oh yeah, lots of good parts. Uh, always nice, you know, when you get a beetle or a bus and you get more stuff with it, it just makes it fun. Part of the adventure, you never know what you're gonna find in these boxes when we get home either. Yeah, we got a couple of fenders, windows, glass, uh, interior pieces. VW lifers <laughs> sometimes you're the bug and sometimes you buy a bug or a That's windshield right. or something Matt Jackson Jake what do you think what do we got here buddy <laughs> well we got this beautiful beautiful beautiful, beautiful. <laughs> 1967 Volkswagen Beetle yes sir uh, you know we got a white Beetle go behind the white van yeah it's a white uh, white car mafia today hey here's the thing folks it's been repainted it's not original paint they said it was original paint that happens sometimes. Got a ton of really good parts. Uh, brand new seats, uh, looking good. Seat upholstery and everything like that. Um, the 67s have a lot of cool one-year-only spots. You gotta do a little Bondo work here. Gonna need to put a headliner in it. Uh, new tires, that kind of thing. But it's a nice, it's a 67 and it's dry. It is as dry as a bone. 
it's going to take a little bit of work, a little effort, but uh, that's what we do at VW Life. Uh, just what we needed another project, right? I don't know what we'll do. Maybe we'll start a little series on this one too. But Should we? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> another series? Maybe just park it inside the shop and let it sit there for about 10 years. <laughs> <laughs> this is what we do. It's fun. Yep. Uh, you know what? It was, a, it was a deal. It was out here in the countryside. It's a beautiful day. Yep. Uh, Jake and you, uh, man, what a great, uh, great amount of teamwork it was right there. All of us uh, yeah. working together. I mean, yeah, I mean, we drove it, so I mean, yeah, it, I mean, run, it starts. Got the new tires on there. Yeah. Uh, I mean, you know, I always get buyer's remorse as soon as I walk away from something, but yeah. I think it's a pretty good deal, and I think it'll make. Uh, we'll, we'll bring it back to a nice. It'll look good. Yeah, we we rescued another one. That's what it's all about. Oh, we did rescue a beetle, didn't we? Yeah, and you get yeah. another sticker on the van. Yeah, that's Ooh. right. Oh, that's even better, Martin. Get on it. Let's get a sticker, Martin. Yeah. So uh, there you go, folks. Uh, time to eat, boy. Let's do it. Let's go eat. Woo. Jake Garrison driving. I feel like I'm just like being like driving Miss Daisy over here. We're in, eating at the Waterburger. Yep. And what happens? We saw Robert. Robert. Robert from San Antonio slash uh, Houston. Yep. And uh, so Robert goes, "Hey, is that the new Harvest Beetle out there?" Yeah. Small world. <laughs> yeah. And he goes, and that was so awesome. So Robert, I hope you see this. And uh, thanks for giving this uh, a, a saying hi, stopping and saying hi to us. But. Yep. Uh, Robert said he's watched us on VW Life a couple times, and uh, yeah, he's got a nice channel with rail. Yeah, green looked really clean. I liked it. Yep. Looking for a bus, so you got a bus for sale? Put in the comments, and we can hook Robert up. Yeah, there you go. good sign 67s are cool well we got a lot of parts golly matt jackson and jake garrison look at this uh vw live we came out uh, we got a 67 beetle and then we got a lot of parts when you look at it wow it's quite a collection we haven't even gone through there i see some pretty cool stuff in there uh so we'll see we'll be going through that uh the next day or so what a good adventure Yes, it was fun. We drove all the way in, got us a beetle. We did. That's that's and that's VW Life, ladies and gentlemen. That's what it's all about, right there. Thank you guys for joining us uh, on this little adventure today. It's been a fun one. What do y'all think? Yeah, I think it was success. Success. Absolutely. Yeah, we got a clean little '67. It'll, it'll be a little work in progress. Mm -hmm. uh, we don't know priority-wise where it's going to end up because there's a lot going on around here, as you guys all know. But uh, uh, nonetheless, hey, it's what it's all about. It's called VW Life. Couple things. Thank you guys so much for your comments. Thank you all for watching. 
it just means the world to us. Continue, spread the news, tell your aunts, tell your uncles, tell all your friends. Click on VW Life, ladies and gentlemen. Hit the subscribe button and the little bell thing so it jiggles and lets you know when you're going to get a new one coming out every Thursday, Matt Jackson. Yep, and get a sticker while you're at it. Thanks, Ooh, guys. Ooh, you can't beat stickers. See you guys later.